guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be doing a mommy and baby haul. If you guys are not into those types of videos, you probably wanna skip on this one. But for those of you who are interested in anything mommy or baby, like, like pregnancy related or baby clothes, stuff like that, then just keep watching. So I picked up some clothes, baby clothes, from TJ Maxx. Sometimes they have a good variety, sometimes they don't. You just have to keep checking, which is just true with anything at TJ Maxx. So I go there, I used to go there very frequently, but since I've been pregnant, I really haven't been going that much at all. So I did find some really cute onesies. These are adorable. So they're just very neutral. If you guys are not aware, we're having a baby boy. His name's going to be Crew. And the theme of his room is black, white, and gray, and with some lion accents. And so, I don't know, I'm kind of drawn to like black, white, clothing right now so I got a lot of black and white stuff but this is so cute these are by the brand Emily and Oliver and it says hug life so cute and then this one's just striped this one is just plain neutral this one's like a Dalmatian type polka dot and then just some stars but super super cute this whole set was $9.99 so I think that's a good price for all of these onesies and this is six to nine months I didn't want to get all like newborn three months you know I wanted a variety and then I got this three to six months it's really cute it says I'm locally grown and it just has some like trees arrows very cute this is by rabbit bear and this was $6.99 just for the one so this is a hundred percent organic cotton which is probably why it's more expensive because because it's organic cotton so it costs a little bit more just for one onesie than like getting the set of the five or six and then I got these these are six to nine months which they actually look longer but skinnier this way from the other nine, six to nine months that I got. So this was $6.99 for these three onesies. And it says, ain't no mama like the one I got. Super cute. And then I'm obsessed with this like sage green. I just, as you can see by my eyes, <laughs> I love this color. And then this has like a little teepee with some arrows on it. Super, super cute. So love those. Then I got this one as well. It's from that same Rabbit Bear Organic. Oh, it says Rabbit Bear Organic by Emily and Oliver. Oh, the other one, the first one I showed you was by Emily and Oliver. Maybe this one, this one must be not organic. That's the difference. So anyway, this one again, it says I'm locally grown. This one is zero to three months, so a little bit smaller. Kind of same prints, but different size, so. I thought those were all super, super cute and I had to pick those up. So I went to TJ Maxx again yesterday. The other stuff I got probably over a month ago. I need to wash it, which is why I'm filming this video. I went to TJ Maxx yesterday or the day, no, I think a couple days ago. I found this really cute mat right here. It's just a big round mat. It's very soft. It has two sides. This side has letters and this side has just stripes. Again, I'm into the very black and white theme. So this is, this was $14.99. It's called Tummy Explore Play Mat Soft and Cozy. And you can reverse it, obviously, because it has two sides. And yeah, it's just for tummy time, basically. So um, I'm really happy I found this. It, I thought it was really cute. And then some of this stuff was actually sent to me in the mail from a friend who can't make my baby shower, so they actually purchased this stuff on Amazon. I have an Amazon registry, which is really cool. And so they can just have it mailed right to your house. So I got a few packages. Um, this is just a book that I had on my registry. If Animals Kissed Goodnight. And then this one is just Baby Touch and Feel Animals. So there's just like textures in there. So yeah. Then I purchased this from Amazon. It's just those cubes that say like you can, you know, take pictures of the baby, whether they're like three months, four months, five months, one year, two years. So I thought these were cute. They're just gray and white. And then anything that I got 
on Amazon. I will link it below in case you guys are interested, like if you're pregnant or maybe you're going to a baby shower or anything like that. So I got some bibs. They're all black, white, and gray. And these are by Parker Baby Company. Banana, baby bandana bibs. And this is the lunar set. Hope you guys can see. Let me just open it up. I haven't even opened this stuff. So they're just all black and white. Super cute prints on them. Black, gray, so those are super cute. Then these are burp cloths, and these are by Up Simples. I just start taking this stuff out because I need to start washing it. But again, just very neutral. I guess they come with a warranty. <laughs> but it's probably past the date. And then I got the Till You Micro Fleece Sleep Bag. This is zero to six months, size small. It has a little elephant on it. So it's just a little sleep sack. Thought it was super cute. I got this really cute like pajama sleeper and it says new to the crew. And this is how my son's name will be spelled, crew. So I thought that was super cute and I really like the color scheme. Then it comes with a little hat. So this is by number, so this looks like it's by 70 is the brand. And yeah. And then I got another sleeper, this one here. This one says, this one's by, oh you know what? I don't know actually what brand the other one. It says 70, this one says 60, I don't know. But this one has a tag, it says Anna Olive Fashion Kids on Amazon. So it has the army print and it says worth the wait. It's just another pajama sleeper. This one I would say is not super soft. The arms are not super soft, but once I wash it, hopefully it'll be softer. And then it has the camo hat, which I think is so cute. I wanna buy some of these like sleepers that are like extremely, extremely soft and stretchy, but God, they're so expensive. But if you guys recommend any brands, let me know in the comments. Because I really want to buy some of those. Like this one is a lot softer material. So this one is by Par Parade. It says always organic, 100% got certified organic cotton, size 3 to 6 months. This is another sleeper. This one's so much softer than the other ones. And again, I just love green like this. So... Uh, maybe I'll have to buy another one. I'll look up this brand on Amazon again and see if they have other ones, other colors that I like. <clears throat> Some things I wanted to buy one of first just to see if I liked them or not. I don't remember if somebody sent me these from Amazon or not. They might have been on my registry. They're from Carter's. They're just little washcloths. Oh, and then this I bought. This is a changing table cover and it's just black. So all the furniture in the bedroom is white. The walls are very light gray, actually the same color as this room that I'm in, which it's probably hard to tell, but over there. It's like a lighter beigey gray. And I'm just putting like black accents. So I'm trying to find a black crib sheet. I don't think this is the crib sheet. I think this is the changing table sheet. Yeah, changing Jersey Changing Cover by Betty Payne. It's very, very soft. I like the jersey material because it's very stretchy and soft. So can't wait to wash all that so I can start putting everything in the room. And then on my registry, I put a backpack because when I had my daughter, I just had like a diaper bag with the strap that goes on the shoulder or you can put it across your body. But I really wanted a backpack diaper bag this time. I just feel like it's more convenient. I actually carry a purse that's a backpack style. It's just easier when you have kids to carry a backpack than it is to carry like a purse that's on your shoulder or a diaper bag because then it constantly falls off and when you're trying to get them out of the car or like pick them up to put in the shopping cart, it's just hard because it's just falling off your shoulder. So I put this one on my registry and somebody bought it for me and it had good reviews which is why I added it but it's by Pee Pee Bear. Love is online forever. Here's the name right here, Pee Pee Bear. So this one is black and gray. They do have one that's solid black um, and it zips open at the top. It 
It has a changing pad inside. It has several compartments in there. And I mean, I hope I like it. Um, has some pockets on the side, a big one in the front here. And then it also has like a pocket, zipper pocket on the back. And then it has these hooks so you can hook it like on a stroller, which is what I plan to do. And I think I bought, oh, I think I have some hooks on my registry um, that you use to attach to the backpack and the stroller. So yeah, this, I'm hoping I really like this. Let me know if you guys have this and you like it or if you recommend any other ones. So I have a whole nother bag of stuff right here to show you guys. Um, I went to Ross and I found a couple of cute outfits. So this was $9.99. It's by Nike. Just says Nike on it. It's black and white. It's super cute. A little onesie. And then I got this one. My husband's very into football, so I thought this one was cute. Comes with little shoes. It says future draft pick. And there's a Target sticker on there for my daughter, probably. This was $7.99. Comes with a little pair of pants on the back. My husband's friend gave us a package for the baby and more clothes here that are black and white and gray. This says new to the crew, kind of like the one that I had purchased. Uh, this is by Cloud Island, which I have some bowls and plates, like kids bowls and plates from them. I got them at Target. So maybe this one they got at Target, I'm not really sure. I don't know. Anyway, these are little bodysuits. So that says new to the crew. That one has little crosses on it. That one's just plain gray. And that one has some like arrows super super cute and somebody gave me the little wubba wubba nub my daughter used one of these for a little bit she wasn't really crazy about pacifiers but once in a while she would take one so this is the, like the kind that we had for her so it's just cute because they can hold on to it the rest of these clothes were gifts this is from Jim Burry. Just some little tiny, I mean, these are so small. These are newborn. Look how tiny they are. <laughs> they look like they would fit a doll. That one comes with a little matching pair of pants. Aren't these adorable? They're so tiny. This one goes with these pants, I think. And then this one, this one's from Carter's. This is from a friend at work. It says, strong like mom. Super cute. It has tires, rhinos, giraffes lions on there and then this one again says new to the crew so perfect this one's adorable i love this one it has sharks on it i just like the colors and then this is by carter's isn't that so cute such a cute little outfit me and a big hug is what this one says this was from a co-worker so cute and i also got these burp cloths and these little things you can hang on their car seat. So cute. And these Carter's little onesies. This one just has some little hats with elephants. Super cute. And then there's some little socks here from Jimbury. These are from my father-in-law actually. This stuff from Jimbury was from my father-in-law. And these little mittens from Gerber and then my father-in-law also got the baby this it says my foot first football and I think he might have got this at Jimbury I'm not really sure but I actually saw this at TJ Maxx a couple days ago and somebody got these these were on my registry these are the Philips Advent like bottles Last time I used Dr. Brown, but I wanted to try something different this time. Not that there was anything wrong with the Dr. Brown ones, but I just wanted to try something new. So I got these. Let me know if you have a preference on baby bottles. Um, I do plan on breastfeeding, but last time I didn't produce very much breast milk, so I would only get like one ounce between both breasts. Like it was like nothing. So if that happens again, obviously I'm gonna need the bottles immediately. I needed a new cover for my boppy. This is a microfiber boppy. This one's just gray and white. It has like plaid and elephants on it. So the one I had before is like a velvety material, but it's pink. So since we're having a boy this time, I needed to 
change it up a little bit. And then I got this maternity belt from Amazon. Um, this is the maternity belt in the black. They also have it in white and I think like a beigey color. It's by Neotech Care. I got a size large. For reference, I am a 5'5 five five and I currently am 174, 174 pounds in case you are pregnant and you are interested in one of these. But it just helps relieve the pressure from the bottom of your belly. It kind of helps lift it up. So I don't wear it all the time. Sometimes I feel like it's a little restricting and I get hot with it on, so I just take it off. But I don't know, sometimes I have more pressure than other days. So when I feel like I have a lot of pressure, I wear it around the house. So yeah, this, this was a handy little thing. Um, it looks exactly like that. Like it's just one big belt. You strap it like on the side and then there's a strap that goes around the top of your belly and it tells you how to do it right here. So I bought that and I've been using it off and on. I also bought a pregnancy pillow. I will link the one that I bought below. I have neck issues so it's been very hard for me because normally I have to lay flat on my back so that my neck is aligned with the rest of my spine. You know, my C-spine is aligned with the rest of my spine but it's been a little challenging because you can't lay flat on your back when you're pregnant. So I don't know, I'm constantly like changing the way I sleep. Sometimes I sleep propped up on my side with like four pillows. <laughs> and then sometimes I use my pregnancy pillow. So I will insert a picture of that and I will link it down below. But I like that because it like hugs my back but also around my front side. The only thing I don't like about it is I really like my down pillow just because I do have those neck issues. So if I just use the pregnancy pillow, it's not that comfortable on my neck sometimes. So I actually got a couple things at TJ Maxx the other day that I forgot about. Um, so I got just this towel, it's really cute, $7.99. It's by um, Hudson Baby. I got this by Modern Baby. It's Every Day I Am Loved. It's another sleeper, so. And then while I'm here, I'll just show you these dresses I got for my daughter. She loves wearing dresses. She, she's like, when I grow up, mom, I wanna be a princess. <laughs> I wanna be like Elsa is what she says. So I got these. This was $12.99, isn't it so cute? It has a unicorn on it, it's so adorable. This is by Zuni. The other one I got is this one right here. This one also has a unicorn. Sparkle, sparkle and shine it says but she loves these. She's been asking me for several days. Mom, can I wear my new dress? Like she wants to wear them immediately when we buy them. But I told her that I wanted her to try them on and wash them first because um, she's very, very particular about the way things feel on her body. So she might not even like the way they feel, I don't know. Last thing I wanna show you is a couple dresses I got at Walmart today actually. So they have this new brand at Walmart. It's not like super new, but it's been there for just a little while. It's called Time and True, and they do have some cute pieces now and again. So I really liked the color of this dress. I love this color green. So I bought these because I'm a I'm one of those people that refuses to buy maternity clothes. Although last week I broke down and bought a couple pairs of maternity jeans just because I'm running out of things to wear that are comfortable. So I just feel like everything's so tight on my waist like my under my belly and it's just uncomfortable so i bought a couple pair of maternity jeans from target and the annoying thing about them is they sit so low that they just kind of start falling down and i have to constantly pull them up so that drives me a little crazy um, but then the kind that like have a little waistband that go all the way above like up your belly those i just get so hot in those because they're made out of polyester and i just don't love those either so it's like hard to find something that you like. But I thought these dresses would be cute because they're very like long and flowy and they were very inexpensive. So these were $9.96. So you know, if you're pregnant or even if you're not pregnant, these are, these are super cute. I will insert like a little clip of me wearing one, but they're just so soft and stretchy and very affordable. The reason I hate buying maternity clothes are so expensive and I'm not gonna be wearing them like I'm due in seven weeks. Why would I wanna spend money on maternity clothes? You know what I mean? I mean, for a pair of like jeans, I think the ones I got at Target were like $30 each. It's ridiculous. So anyway, I got that one and then I got up just a solid black. 
And again, I will try to insert a little picture of me trying them on just so you can see what they look like. But I thought they're just so comfortable to wear while I'm pregnant and I can still wear them after I'm pregnant. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys have any recommendations like on baby stuff that you like, like for instance, those sleepers that I'm talking about that are so soft and stretchy, it's actually like material like this. And uh, I'd be interested to know which brands you recommend. So sorry, I'm short of breath as usual, but thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys. Have a great day. Bye.